Switch Cork 5s are a fun way to get truly corked for the first time instead of being on a flippy Switch Rodeo axis or being perfectly upright with the Switch 540. Before getting corky, let's make sure you can pull around Switch 5s easily with the skis on. So being able to get your grab solid and controlling the spin with a shifty is helpful moving into Switch Cork 5. To figure out the cork, we're going to use some seat drops. So pull off your skis to get the feel down. When you land on your seat drop, have your hands on the tram beside you. That supports your back. Let's hop into your switch position and pull a switch 90 to a seat drop. At first, don't worry about anything technical but landing safely on your seat drop. Getting into the real progressions, let's make it a switch 180 to a seat drop. It's normal to land a little bit too far forward on your seat drop. To avoid that, allow your shoulders to be a couple of degrees forward on your toes so when you spin, you land on your seat slightly leaning back. Next, let's add even more. Another 90 so that we can make it to 270 before landing on your seat. Stay centered on the trampoline since you'll be landing perpendicular to it and won't have lots of space. To work on the landing, we need a seat drop roll up 270. To make this feel and look right, you'll need tons of practice leaning off of your leading hand to get corked. Let's face the same direction our 270 seat drop brought us to. Drop into a seat drop and spin a 90 up. That should be relatively easy. If not, focus on your trailing leg and toes and aim them into the direction you're going. That should help. Now let's add another 90 off your seat. Then another 90 so we have a total of a 270 off of your seat drop. Time to put your 270 seat drop together with your seat drop 270, combining to a total of a 540. Put in some time practicing these two motions together. Always try and initiate your seat drop at 180 or later during the first part. Keep your legs and toes driving into your seat drop position instead of letting them fall down. Lastly, let's take your Switch 5 and make it corky. So while you're spinning your Switch 5, focus on spotting beside you at 270. Make sure you can really see it by clapping or grabbing at 270. This is the key part. Set your switch 540 and at 270 bring your legs up into a seat drop position. If your feet come up to your body without your upper body moving, you'll feel an offset which is your cork. If your upper body drops, then your legs will cork you funky or not at all. So try a little bit at a time if you need to. Once you really got it, throw on the tramp skis and give it a try. This tutorial was filmed at Whistler Bounce. I'm Dean Burkers from Ski Addiction, helping you ski better.